Happy holidays, everybody. I'm Dave Gingon, and I'm here on the court at Oracle Arena after the Warriors' 89-83 victory over the Cleveland Cavaliers, a game that everyone was looking forward to all season long, maybe the premier matchup so far in the NBA season. This was the first meeting between these two teams since last year's NBA Finals. But this time, LeBron is not alone. He has both Kyrie Irving and Kevin Love back in the lineup. It was a defensive battle. LeBron James had 25 points to lead the Cleveland Cavaliers. Draymond Green led the Warriors with 22. Steph Curry had 19. And Klay Thompson had 18 points. And after the game, both teams said that they didn't feel like they played very well. Offensively, we were just... Uh we didn't have it. No one had it. And um, uh, we just try to continue to give ourselves an opportunity. You know, myself, I, I wasn't very good offensively, um, inefficient, and uh, just trickled down to everybody else. And, uh, you know, we, we missed out on a great opportunity, but at the same time, uh, you know, defensively, we, 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 we improved tonight for sure. I don't, I don't think we played well. Um, even tonight, we did some good things, but I still don't think we played well. And, it's part of it that pisses me off and it's part of it that makes me very, very happy. So I think we got a lot of improving to do and we will. Our offense haven't been flowing. We haven't been executing very well. Um, and we haven't been putting the amount of stops together that we want. So there's some things to clean up, but at the end of the day, a win like that, you have to definitely take it. And Why does it make obviously, you, you can grow off of it, but you know it's a good win. If our defense shows up, we're pretty good shape to win games um, and we just show our versatility and trying to win different ways so offense was was nice at times and then missed some some good looks that we usually make and all that but we, we answered on the other end and uh, made it happen. In the Warriors locker room after the game there was a cameo appearance by Riley Curry and we spotted Drake again this time he was chatting it up with 14-time World Series of Poker champion Phil Helmuth, who lives here in Palo Alto. Well, it was a nice Christmas Day battle between the best team in the West and the best team in the East. The Warriors are now 28-1. The Cavs are now 19-8. And, and once again, happy holidays. We'll see you soon here on the court.